Hello students, now our next point is word problems. In that the example is given, there are 215 oranges totally in 5 baskets. If there are equal number of oranges in each basket, how many oranges are there in each basket? So how many oranges are there? 215 oranges are there. And how many baskets are there? Number of basket is equal to 5. And what we have to find? that each basket contains how many oranges so what we will do we'll perform division over here so 215 divided by 5 so now we'll divide so we'll go for one digit at a time as first digit is what 2 but if you go through the table you will find out that 2 doesn't come in 5's table so we'll take first two numbers so, 2, 1, 21 is our number. So, we have to find 21 in 5's table. So, 21 doesn't come in 5's table. So, which smaller number comes? That is 20. At which place? 5, 4 is a 20. Now, sorry, subtraction minus. So, 21 minus 20 is what? 1. Now, bring down its next number that is 5. So, now number has become 15. So, Count the table of 5 up to 15. So 5 how many is a 15? 5 3 is a 15. So 15 5 3 is a 15. Now we will do subtraction. So 15 minus 15 is 0. So how many oranges are there in one basket? That is 43. So you will write the answer as thus there are 43 oranges in each basket. So with the help of this we will start our next that is exercise 2.8. In that, the first example is given. Smita plans to make 244 mats. She divides the work equally among four women. How many mat, mats does each woman make? Okay, so Smita plans to make 244 mats. And she distributes this work among four women. So, we have to find one woman make how many mats. So, you will write here how many mats. Number of mats is equal to what? Number of mats is equal to 244. And how many women are there? Number of women is equal to 4. So, what we will do? We will perform division 244 divided by 4. So, now we will take first two numbers for division. That is 24. So, we have to find 24, 24 in 4's table. At which place we got 24? 4 how many is a 24? 4, 6 is a 24. So, 4, 6 is a 24. So, we will do subtraction. So, minus so, 4 minus 4 is 0, 2 minus 2 is 0. Now, we will bring down its next number that is 4. So, 4 how many is a 4? 4 ones are 4. So, 4 ones are 4. So, 4 minus 4 is what? 0. So, 1 woman make how many mats? 61 mats. So, you will write the answer thus. Each woman make 61 mats. Now next is what? 400 balloons were bought for classroom decoration. The teacher divides it equally between Rohit, Navin and Karthik. How many does each of them get? How many balloons are left? So, how many number of balloons are there? 400 and that is for classroom decoration. So, teacher divides that whole, all balloons in between Rohit, Navin and Karthik. So, how many balloons each of them got and how many are left that we have to find. So, you will write here number of balloons. Is equal to 400. And number of students, how many? Number of students how many are they rohit navin and karthik how many three so you will write over here three 
so what you will do you will divide it 400 divided by 3 so we'll take one number at a time so first number is 4 so we have to find 4 in 3's table but you will find out that 4 doesn't come in 3's table so which smaller number will take 3 right so at which place 3 1's are 3 so 4 minus 3 is what 1 so now we'll bring down its next number that is 0 so number is become 10 now so we have to find 10 in 3's table but 10 doesn't come in 3's table so which smaller number will take which is smaller than 10 that is 9 so 3 3 is a 9 so 10 minus 9 is 1 now we'll bring down its next number that is 0 again 10 is there so as we know 10 doesn't come so which smaller number we have taken here 9 so 3 how 3 3 is a 9 so 10 minus 9 is 1 again now no number is left so our division is finished over here so each boy or the each student got how many balloons 133 and how many left then 1 so you will write over here thus 133 balloons and how many balloons are left so one balloon is left now next is 3 there are 2416 books arranged in 8 cupboards equally how many books are there in each cupboard so shelf is given or the cupboard is given so in each cupboard how many books are there 2416 books are there so we have to find that one cupboard has how many books so you will write here number of books is equal to is equal to 2416 and how many cupboards that is number of cupboards is equal to 8 so we have to find one cupboard has how many books so we'll do division so 2416 divided by 8 so we'll take first two digit for the division so first two digit is what 24 so 8 how many is a 24 8 threes are 24 so 8 threes are 24 so 24 minus 24 is what 0 now we'll bring down its next number that is 1 after division or in division only first time we'll take two numbers after that we can't take two numbers at a time so we have to bring down only one number so this thing you have to remember only only at the first time we can take two numbers after that we have to go through one one digit only so we'll take one digit at a time so one so we have to find one in eight table but we know that one doesn't come in eight table so which smaller number comes in eight table that is less than one or the smaller than one that is zero so eight zeros are zero right so one minus zero is one now bring down its next number that is 16 so we have to find out 16 in 8 stable 8 how many is a 16 8 2 is a 16 so 16 minus 16 is what zero so one cupboard has how many books 302 books so you will write over here thus each a board has 302 books now next is fourth the principal wants to divide the student of the school into four groups each with equal number of students if there are 2639 students in a school 
how many students will be there in each group are they are there any students left okay so a principal of the school wants to divide that number of students in four equal groups and how many students are there 2639 students are there in that school so each group contains how many students that we have to find and if is there any student left that we have to find so you will write here number of students is equal to 2639 and how many groups are there number of groups is equal to 4 so what we will do we will divide 2639 by 4 so i hope you can do this division and you will find out the answer how many groups are there and is anyone left or not next is there are nine rows in the theater containing equal number of chairs if the total number of chairs in the theater is 585 how many chairs are there in each row so a theater is given in that theater how many rows are there number of rows are nine how many lines are there nine lines and how many chairs are there in that line 585 chairs so in each line in one line how many chairs are there that we have to find so we'll write here number of rows rows here means lines the horizontal line called as rows so rows is 9 and number of chairs are is equal to 585 so what we will do we will divide 585 by 9 so we'll go for one digit but 5 is smaller so we'll take first two digits for the division so we have to find 58 in 9 table so 9 how many is a 58 so if you go through the table you will find out that 58 doesn't come in 9 table so which smaller number we can take instead of 58 that is 54 9 how many is a 54 9 6 is a 54 right so 54 so 8 minus 4 is 4 5 minus 5 is 0 now we'll bring down its next number that is 45 so number is become 45 so we have to find out 45 in 9 table so 9 how many is a 45 9 5 is a 45 so 45 45 minus 45 is 0 so in each row how many chairs are there 65 so you will write here therefore or thus 65 chairs are there in each row now next is sixth in a toy manufacturing company there is an order to manufacture 3843 toys in seven days how many equal number of toys should be manufactured each day to meet the target so a toy manufacturing company got an order order to make a 3843 toys in how many days seven days so what we have to find we have to find that in one day how many toys they will make so that they can finish their target that is the 3843 toys in seven days so what we will write here number of toys is equal to what 3843 and how many days are there number of days how many seven so what we will do we will divide 3843 by 7 so we'll take two number at a time because 3 is smaller than 7 so we can take two numbers for first time so we'll take two numbers 38 
so we have to find 38 in 7th table but if you go through the table you will find out that 38 doesn't come in 7th table so which smaller number will take that is 35 so 7 how many is it 35 7 5 is a 35 so 38 minus 35 is how many 3 right 8 minus 5 is 3 3 minus 3 is 0 now bring down its next number that is 34 now we have to find 34 in 7th table but we know that 34 doesn't come in 7th table so which smaller number will take which is smaller than 34 so that is 28 so 7 4 is a 28 so do the subtraction so 34 minus 28 we'll do forward counting in the subtraction 28 up to 34 so to, after 28 29 30 31 32 33 34 35 so how many that is 7 so we'll write 7 and now bring down its next number that is 3 sorry 34 minus 28 is what 6 so 6 and we'll bring down its next number that is 63 so number is become 63 now we have to find 63 in 7 table so 7 how many is a 63 7 9 is a 63 so 63 63 minus 63 is 0 so what is our quotient 549 so what is the answer so each day therefore or thus each day 549 toys should be manufactured to reach the target. So this is how we have finished our exercise 2.8 here.